Well, Colorado's had a lot of great leaders, uh, but I think my personal favorite has always been Ralph Carr. He was elected in, in uh, 1940 as a Republican, very moderate Republican, and at that time, after Pearl Harbor, the United States, I mean, the whole country became fanatic, paranoid that any Japanese Americans were a risk. And so they began transporting American citizens who were of Japanese descent, putting them in essentially in internment camps, concentration camps. And there was one in Southern Colorado, and Ralph Carr would have none of them. And he said, these are American citizens. We have a constitution for this country. It doesn't matter what your religion is, what you look like, you will get treated equally. So he basically fought it tooth and nail and made sure that uh, even where, he, where we had to have a camp, it was completely different than any other camp, a maximum amount of freedom. And he went from being talked about as, as, a, as a legitimate vice presidential candidate uh, for 1944 to losing his re-election in 1944 because he wouldn't back off. He felt that you know American citizens should have equal protection under the law.